Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah, Today, we're going to be talking to a good friend of mine. Not only is he a brother in arms, but he's also a brother in another way. And we'll talk about that sometime during this video. But uh, like I've always said, our armed forces need to get the support and the respect that they deserve, uh, deserve, deserve <laughs> both away from home in home. So I'm going to introduce, I know him as Slim, but you would know him as Watson. Uh, we're going to go over to him, let him tell you a little bit about himself and his life and the, and the armed forces. So over to you there, uh, Slim. <laughs> We probably ran into each other, didn't even know it. 
probably did because of what, well, I don't know because at that time I was switching over from the Navy to Army. Oh, it's still your fault. It's still your fault. It is. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, and then I was going through that uh, Warrior Transition course mm -hmm. um, at that time. And matter of fact, that was the first time I seen, I think you seen my whole time there, I seen about three deck on tornado. Wow. I was like, no, nah, I'm good on that. Hey, like, but let's see, Georgia, I'm guessing you was there, uh, oh, Robert? Right now. Yeah. What's that one? No, that ain't an Air Force base in, uh, Albany. Is it Albany? I know they got a base down in Albany. You talking about, um, um, you talking about Moody? Yeah. Down that way. Down Moody Air Force base, yeah. Better. Okay. Yeah. Because see, we had Roberts and in Atlanta there's a reserve base in Dobbins. Yes. So it's very confusing. Stupid hell is confusing. Okay, no. <laughs> <laughs> so, let me see. You've been through all of those places. Um, did you ever grow leave the the States, the United States? Yeah. Now we're not going to go into any sensitive subjects that he don't want to touch on because we don't want to open up any old scars because he is a vet. We're going to show the utmost respect um, to all veterans who have been through something. But without opening up any wounds, like where outside of the country have you been? Okay. We're going to start in um, 2005. When I got a boy on my birthday, yeah, I'm mad at that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. That guy's so. Oh, yeah. yeah, he did, yeah, he did. But, uh, let's see. Went to Canada again, not Canada, I remember that. Canada, okay. Turkey, for some other reason. Now, Turkey, I didn't like Yeah, they went over that far. He was dirty. We went in to get off the plane, that's how dirty it was, but nobody knew where it was. Some of us went to Hungary. Hungary was nice. Let's see, we were there, so. I'd have been with Afghanistan. Dude, it was so many freaking places, man. I just know we just we, we just dropped stuff and boom. That was it. And I'm like, why are we leaving stuff for the world? We dropped stuff. But that got all I can actually remember when I was looking through paper. Uh, yeah. So you never really well with Turkey, you never really got to go out and really see the sights. Not really. It, no 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 for the photo shoot, nothing like that. Cause I know, I know when uh, we went, I was still in the Navy at the time, and I kid you not, the water, it was like you could see a, a line <laughs> where you had clear, pretty water, and it separated, it and separated it to like dark green, yep. yellow water. But it was the first time I actually got to see uh, a, a real life belly dance when I was over there. Now, I'm going to tell you something, because I got home to P. 
fit with the Air Force. I okay. think. And actually, most of the military got a bone to pick with the Air Force. Y'all right. living conditions were a whole lot better than every other branch out there. The only thing I can say with that is, those others, they know what, they love comfort. So therefore, they're gonna make it comfortable. If I gotta be here, they better make it comfortable. Because even y'all chow hall, mm -hmm. y'all got the best food. Matter of fact, I was at Langley Air Force Base. Langley, oh yeah. And uh, I got the pleasure of eating that chow hall. And that crap was like a restaurant place. Like I ordered my food and went and sat down. Like <laughs> they brought it to me and then they like said just get up and leave and they'll clean up the tray. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wow. No other branch does that. In the branch that does that, they shot me. Like, what, what up? Then, like, y'all, barracks was a whole lot natural. Like, yeah, for instance, yeah. my whole interaction with y'all were y'all were the rich children spooning y'all mouth, and everybody else were the red headed stepchild. Yeah, yeah, this is the only problem with that. I keep hearing that a lot. I didn't get no silver spoon at all. I'm a bad. I'm a bad. But I tell you, I, I, I did for a long time. Matter of fact, just by every other branch would say, mm -hmm. man, forget the Air Force. You know what I'm saying? They don't, they're not really military. They sit in chairs. Yeah, they, yeah, that's it. The chair force. The chair force. <laughs> I, I, I did not get issued out of one damn chair. What? <laughs> <laughs> but I mean the chair force. Okay. But I don't know. You you're in for what, 01 to 11? Nine years, four months, 22 days. Hey, you got time. <laughs> hey, nine years, four months, 22 days. How many of y'all can say y'all can do that? Um, <laughs> in all that time, I would say, uh, sir, um, did you ever have any regrets?
get an opportunity to do something, do it. Get an opportunity to do something, do it. That's the only thing I can say. Because you miss out on not just staying in the shadows, and that comes from somebody that loves the shadows. So, yeah, do it. That's the only thing I say. Do it. You won't regret it. I agree with that. No, you won't. You know, you, you, no other job out there or career, let's say that, where yeah. you will be able to see things that pretty much 90% of the population will ever get to see. Exactly. You'll get to go places that 90% of the population won't ever be able to go. Yeah. And you'll be able to experience those things. But, um, Take a short break from, you know, with us in the military. The other reason that this is my brother, and I'm pretty sure you see it on this table, is that huge R uh, sitting there. Yes, this is my brother in Rough Rides. Uh, and he actually was one of, and I, can, I tell you, I remember uh, me prospecting. Um, he was the one, one of the one, one of the, actually it was only two, because it was only you and Dream that actually spoke to me. Nobody else really did. Wow. Well, size fly by, but he was a prospect man. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. He was a prospect man. Yeah, yeah, of course he goes back. Yeah, so he, he, he spoke to me. But really, that really actually kind of sat me down and talked to me and, and got me to be a vested member, it was him, Dream, and Fly. So I, I hold him a special place with him as being a brother and family um, uh, that represents the R, which, oddly enough, most of our chapter are actually prior military. Pretty much. So <laughs> the, <laughs> it, it kind of fit in pretty good with that. Um, so He's been part of the the family for quite a bit longer than I have. I think I've been I've been part of the family probably about two, three years now. That's it? Yeah. I think so. It's 2020. No, five. Carry the one, carry the one. Yeah, five years I've been. But I'm gonna let him tell you, since he you know say he's more of a veteran than I am, I'm gonna let him tell you about the R, about what the lifestyle is all about, and um, about what we stand for and and how we are with each other. So, instead of waxing at this point in time, you know what I'm saying, we're gonna go with Rough Rider Slim. Rough Rider Slim. Yeah. <laughs> all right, okay. That's what's up. All right. Welcome back to me, yeah. All right, <laughs> let's start your work out. I only got vested in 2000, yeah. 2007. Yeah. Yeah, I had carried one. Right? Yeah. So you got vested in about eight years before I even thought about the prospect. Okay. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I just fell right in. And Somebody else here in this chapter that's longer than me who brought me in. Shades. Shades? Oh, okay. Shades, old sex guy. Dang. Yeah. He brought me in. So, I'm like, wow. And I saw the love, you know, you know, different accidents and people working together to help. I, I see that and I'm like, I love that. You know, because I want somebody to help me. If I, I, if I go there, I'm going to go back in. Yeah. Yeah. Now I'm like, wow. I'm like, okay. I'm like, you know, that's all they do. Just get back to it and be good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We good. That. This the way. I don't want to change nothing. And I got to tell everybody, I don't need no position or whatever. I'm cool being so Y'all love me. We good. <laughs> <laughs> that's it. We so, good. In, 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 in a sense, we just one big family. I mean, don't get me wrong. You you have your your rank structure just like the military. Yeah. You have your 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 presidents and your VPs so so on. Yeah. But
But, you know, just like the military, we have your soldiers. Yeah. And, uh, we, yeah, just like that. And we look out for one another as we do. And, 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 and we protect one another. Not only one another, but one another's families. Yes, uh, we do. I can remember, I would say shortly, a little bit after I completed my prospecting period, uh, who was it? It was since it was his. She she showed uh she came about, but you wasn't there at the time. Oh, I was there. So it was a transmission. I'm coming back. Yeah, I was there when you saw my now. You know, we all asked her. You know what I'm saying? Where you were? And she was like, Yeah, he coming so for so on. So pretty much, while you were not there, and even though he, even when he is there. You know, everybody protects everybody. Everybody watches out for everybody. And everybody shows love to everybody. And outside of the military, this is, I would say, the third uh, group that I became a part of that, you know, I fell in love with, I became a family with. Oh, no, the second group was, uh, channel 
And uh, as always, like and subscribe, hit that notification bell, and comment on anything else that you would like to see or know. You know, if you got any questions for Slim, you know, I'll make sure I pass those on to him. And Slim is a book of information. He don't mind answering questions. <laughs> but until we meet again out there, better ambassador, we love you. Throwing up the R's for you. One love, we out.